Okay, so today I am going to organize my shelves. I have my pile of Christmas decorations already right here on this bench. It's around 7 p.m. on a Saturday, so if I don't get it all done today, I'll probably just do more tomorrow. I'm gonna do my best. I know I'm going to have to take everything off of the shelves and first of all, I'm gonna have to dust. I haven't dusted my shelves in quite a bit. You know, you just kinda leave them there to admire from afar and then you like just wanna look at them and then you're like, oh wait, I should probably dust. I have quite a few piles of stuff around here. Let me show you. As usual, I love to stack things up. Yeah, this is how it's looking but I have a lot of books and albums that I need to put up here. But I'm gonna get started before it gets way too late and then I decide I wanna just go to sleep like I have every single other time that I wanted to film this video. So let's get to it. <laughs> Everything is here and I have no idea <laughs> how I am going to organize it. I feel like I always run into this problem where I try and categorize everything and just like kind of move it through relevancy to me and like order in some type of way. But I'm finding that even though I thought I cleared up space, um, I didn't clear up enough because I don't even have half of the books that I already had up here before. But yet, it doesn't really seem like I cleared up any space by taking those books off of here because, yeah, I, I guess I just accumulated so much stuff, it's just not balancing out. And so we're stuck with our same problem as before. But I do have a small solution to this that I could have. I just kind of have to figure out how I want to organize it. And that is this shelf. On my little shelf over here, I have this. I used to keep my makeup here because I used to do my makeup at this mirror, but I don't anymore. So I took my makeup from over here and now this shelf is totally empty. There's clearly nothing on it but that owl diffuser and that pink dog. <laughs> and yeah, so I could totally put things there. It's just that I kind of have to figure out what I want to put over there. And that also brings a dilemma. What goes over there? How do I decide? Do I make that another BTS shelf and then just move things around? Or do I make that... What do I put there? My girl groups? My next top girl groups? 
Or do I let it be like kind of miscellaneous? Whatever I put up there, I kind of wanted to be something that will look good together. So I don't really have enough stuff to really make it a full BTS shelf, but I could probably put some of my BTS stuff over there. Like, like this big old BTS world box. I could totally put this over there and I think it would look pretty good. Like if I have it shown like that. And then I could put my memories of 2018 over there too. And those could be like the only two BTS things that I keep over there for now. So yes, that is everything for today, and I will see you tomorrow. Um, I'm just quickly gonna go over my shelves. Yes, if you didn't see, I do have the full set of the BTS dolls. It's actually, um, it's actually pretty funny because my mom was the one who really wanted to get all of the dolls. Every time we went to Target or Barnes & Noble, she was like, we need to go see if they have the dolls. So that's what we did and we managed to get all of them. And because I'm the collector, I have to store all of them. So they are just up there. I really want to get a trunk one day just to be able to keep like things like that just off to the side and not always 
right there looking like that <laughs> anyways so my first shelf didn't really change much I just added a few little accents there that are kind of Christmassy but I still have the same stuff on this shelf as I did in my last shelf organization so as you can see I have all of their Korean discography and then some of their Japanese my human Tony Montana pin like yes love that for me uh <laughs> the shelf is pretty nice the main accent of it is obviously this thing <laughs> and I really like it it just kind of stands out right there and the shelf hasn't really changed much not that there's a lot of room to add anything to it and of course my prized studio picture is right there uh this is my red velvet shelf i love this shelf dearly but it is very crammed now with stuff i have obviously all of their albums and their japanese stuff joy ornament which of course is appropriate for joy and then the little gingerbread house in the tree these albums are really stacked i have no more room for day three and yeah everything is just kind of stuffed in there i'm gonna have to remove the light stick too but i guess i'll get to that when i get to that infinite and some girl group things i have this sign that says don't get your tinsel in a tangle as you saw in the earlier part of this video i moved these albums over here it looks pretty good i think there is this mess over here which is pretty much all of my bigger bts packages i don't even think there's any other group over here it's just bts because i just have so much for them and uh yeah these are the premium photos that i have for yingi and jimin and then obviously just the packagings from like everything and bags and old banners from previous concerts and these are all filled with different packages that i have from different merch so that hasn't changed it's still stuffed to the brim these are just all the magazines and like fan site stuff i put this little garland i made last year for bts i was actually gonna do a diy video of me making these <laughs> <laughs> but then I was like, I don't even know if anyone would care about this DIY. It's not that fascinating, but yeah, so I just made that and I, I think it's pretty nice. It's stood up. Still works. And this one, this one doesn't have anything really Christmassy in it besides that little ornament, but you know, that works. And then this one which has the Santa hat and then this one pretty basic too and then my Sailor Moon <laughs> focused cubby I really like this one cuz I love Sailor Moon so you know and then this not a lot of Christmas decorations down here. This shelf also ended up looking really nice. It looks really great whenever you walk into my room and like you see the Merry Christmas. So I love that. And then I took this little whiteboard sign and I put the day of the Itzy showcase that I'm going to. So I'm really, really excited for that. Let's go. Christmas tree, Christmas Day. 
Yeah. 